In today's video, I'll be showing you how to change the graphics preference of an app or game in Windows 11. So the first thing you need to do is right click on the start menu icon and you now need to click on settings. You now need to select gaming in the left hand menu and you now need to click onto game mode and you now need to select graphics. You will now see a list of apps below. So at the moment you can see it says let Windows decide and they will be using the power saving option. However, if I click onto say the camera app and then click onto options, I can change the graphics preference. So I can change it to high performance if I want to and then press save. The camera app will now use the high performance power option. If I want to add a new app or game to the list, then I can do this by going to the top here where it says add an app. I can then select desktop app and click onto browse. I can now browse for the game or program that I would like to add. I'm going to go ahead and find a game now to add. So once you have found the game that you want to add, you then need to select the games.exe. So I'm going to use Battlefield 4 as the example here and then click onto the add button. You can now see that Battlefield 4 has been added. If I now click onto options, I can now click onto high performance and then press save. And Battlefield 4 will now use the high performance power plan. If I click on the drop down menu and select Microsoft Store app, I can then click onto browse and I can now select from a massive list of all the apps that have been installed through the Microsoft Store and also the Xbox app. So if you've just installed a game through the Xbox app like Back for Blood, then it will be in this list here. You will then be able to select the app and then you will then be able to click onto options again and then select the high performance option if that's what you want to use. So that is how you change the graphics preference in Windows 11. I hope this video has helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.